let's get it that's right you see the right I think when it comes to going into an interview it's about recognizing who you are as well so if you are more of a relaxed person I wouldn't put too much pressure on yourself to go into the interview and trying to be more performative to perform that you are experienced or know what you're doing I think it's just about that genuine authenticity if you're a bit more of a relaxed person then be relaxed in the interview but still try and remain that degree of professionalism so how I'm talking now is not that much different than I would talk in an interview because that's typically how I am generally if you talk to me um, on a regular day this is pretty much how I'm going to speak so when I go into interviews I try to speak with passion but I don't try to overperform the fact that I really want to, to have this opportunity because I just think it gets to a point where you're continually going to be trying to find that authentic version of yourself that comes across a certain way in an interview I think if you just go in there with more of the perspective that I'm going to be myself, I'm going to be genuine, I'm going to talk about my experiences, it will feel a little less pressurised because already interviews can feel a little bit tense but I think if you go in there, compose yourself and speak as you normally would speak to people, I think then you will come across as, as more genuine. You, you want to be working in an environment where you don't feel on edge all the time and I want my interview to reflect that. So yes I'll be professional but I want to be able to engage, I want it to be more of a conversation and um, I think those are the types of interviews that I tend to do better at than when it feels like they're grilling me and it just feels a little bit more like a data quality assessment rather than someone taking a genuine interest in me. So when I'm interviewing people I always try to help them to feel a little bit more relaxed but there are lots of different career coaches that you can have a look at and find what works for you but for me I think it's about being relaxed but remaining professional and making sure that you're clear and concise in your answers. If you don't get through your first interview, if you don't get through the next one, don't worry just keep persevering because perseverance is the key to success. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video and all the best with your career prospects. Drop a comment if you have found this video useful and like and subscribe so that you can receive more of this content. All the best for the future. Peace and love. Take care.